Now inside seven minutes until launch. Pre-launch operations now complete at the launch pad. The uh, closeout crew uh, was evacuated uh, in a bus to a safe distance away from the launch pad about uh, 30 minutes ago after inspecting the launch pad to make sure that no foreign uh, object debris was present that would interfere uh, with uh, the main engine start. Flight recorders are now up and running uh, on the uh, Soyuz booster and the Progress uh, resupply ship, according to uh, technicians in the blockhouse at Baikonur. We should advise you that the uh, video that we're receiving from the Russian Federal Space Agency uh, from Baikonur is uh, erratic. Uh, it is freezing from time to time. So uh, if that occurs uh, during any portion of our broadcast, liftoff or ascent of the vehicle while it is still in sight, you'll know what the issue is. T-minus 10 seconds and counting. Engine start has begun. And liftoff is confirmed. Liftoff confirmed at 2.53 and 6 seconds p.m. Central Time. The 53rd Progress Resupply Ship en route on a holiday mission to the International Space Station. The Soyuz uh, now uh, going through its period of maximum dynamic pressure. Engine and combustion chamber performance is all nominal according to the reports on the blockhouse at Baikonur.